This is a demonstration of the new Hermes IS400 diamond drag and rotary engraving machine. And we're going to be engraving a GI tag which measures approximately one inch from up and down, two inches left to right. The program we're going to be using is called Grava Style 98. And I have set up my parameters and we have render, render's name in there to change the font. We double click, everything in red will change. So we'll take it and we'll make it an italic C. We'll select the italic C and we'll click on the screen and everything will change. So if we want to pick another font, suppose it's a script font, just click the font, press on the screen and it changes. Once we've done all our editing and we have in there what we'd like, we go to click on our little arrow key, which will bring up our engraving parameters. We're going to click on the little machining function and we're going to tell it we want a regular ABC going left to right. We're going to be engraving from the center of the vise. And we're going to give it the speed. We're going to run it at its maximum speed. And this function here will tell it the depth of what we would like to engrave. It's not going to engrave a deep depth because it's working on spring tension. But we want to tell the machine to go down from the surface of it, down 25,000 so there's spring tension on the machine to get some depth with the diamond drag. This function here is our retraction. What this will give us is a retraction after each character for the head to come off the top of the plate so we don't have dragging across the entire part. So you need a little space for the machine's head to come up. We're going to be shutting off our rotary because we're going to be diamond drag engraving. There is no fluid going in there and there's no auxiliary functions. Once we have all of this, we're going to send it to our port. You can either test it or you can send it to the port. So I know it's going to work, so I'm just going to select my port. And I'm going to select Run. Once I set Run, this will be sent to the machine. It's the machining in progress. And our little handheld controller has told us that we have everything. We're ready to engrave. We're going to push our green button. And it goes that quick. And you can see how it retracts the head up that 100 thousandths every time it makes a character. And you can also see the compression of the spring as it's going up and down to get the downward pressure. That's that 25 thousandths that we set up for. If you set that for zero, the spring really isn't going to do its job and it's just going to skate over the top of the part. It will engrave, but it won't be very deep and it won't be very clean. This is a 120 degree diamond rag cutter. And look, there's the final date. And we are done. Here's your final engraving of Brenda, the IS-400, July 8th. And there's a, another quick look. So once you're done, just go cancel, and you're ready for your next engraving. That is the New Hermes IS-400 engraving machine.